state government has contributed $900,000 to really what is a $3.48 million investment. So we've seen state government put money in, we've seen the federal government put money in, but what's really, really impressive is the fact that the community here has raised over a million dollars. Uh, and that's well and truly over what was expected. It's, a, it's an accolade and it needs to be acknowledged, but Catholic Education have done a fantastic job. But in getting that collaborative community spirit to be able to raise those funds and make a contribution, that has been absolutely fundamental. Kids in grids, um, cell block classrooms is, is very much an industrial model that, that used to fit an industrial world. But our children aren't stepping out into those jobs in the future. Our children are going to be collaborating using ICT skills with people from all around the world. Uh, it's more about emotional intelligence. It's more about having the ability to negotiate. It's more about the ability to have creative thinking. The, these are all skills that, that um, don't, you, you can't facilitate that type of learning in a traditional classroom as much as you can in this type of environment. We know now, um, and the science tells us, and there's overwhelming evidence to say that natural light, um, maybe less structure in the classroom, uh, understanding some of the learning challenges that might not have been recognised a long time ago. All of these are key in presenting modern and successful education. And in doing so, you need to be able to acknowledge that the classrooms have to be done a little differently. It's those visionaries that see what they need over and above what exists now, and they don't build for now, they don't build for yesterday, they build for what the kids are going to need in the future. You know, when you look at it from a distance, it's quite challenging because it is an innovative learning environment. It's, it's non-traditional. Um, but having moved in, the teachers love it. They said they'd never go back. Um, they really enjoy the fact that we, we learn as a community. So the, the whole year level is in the one space instead of three different classrooms. So it's a real community feel and it also opens up the capacity to do a lot more collaboration but also a lot more diversity in the curriculum that we're covering as well. For years we've been all worried about having children in the classroom with their friends because they need to be focused on their work. But when I talk to the children, they talk about how it actually does make them feel better and they are able to do more work when they do have their friends around them to, to help them understand what's going on. So there's little benefits coming out that we wouldn't have anticipated. I think the best thing about the building is all the space in it. Like you, when we're learning, we can just move around the space. We're not always just in one room. So there's a lot of different rooms we can learn in. So, and sometimes we get separated into our learning abilities, so that's a bit easier for us. So it's really nice and spacious. We can go around when, like, when we're doing maths because we have three different groups. Um, also, it's really good because we have a book nook. We can, after like this lunch, we can all just have mindfulness and chill out and read a book. I'd say great job. It's really good. We get a lot of space and it's kind of made just for us kind of thing. Well, I say very good job because they even got these sound buffering so if we are really bad, they can't, like, everyone around the classroom can't hear us so there's really a lot of good things in there. When we were trialling this last year even we had parents saying I don't know what you're doing but my child's more engaged and I think it's that community approach to learning um, and also the fact that we can, we've got more um, flexibility to create groups of children on uh, collaborative tasks that we know will work together. So there's been a lot of positives there. There are some children that are a little bit more hesitant in the space and that's when we're working with them to find out what are the elements they enjoy and we're really trying to emphasise those elements for those students. But overall it is, it is a step forward and it is a step uh, I think towards better education for those children but also a better community. I think that's really important. Yeah.